Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. Let's see if we can get up to the top and hopefully not get knocked down by these Gligar fluttering about here. It should be okay because they aim for where your, where your last spot was when they go brrrr. Yes. <laughs> So you should be out of their range once you get past them, you know, if you keep moving and whatnot. So yes, I definitely am glad I saved before I got to this point because there was no save point beside this temple. So, yep, yep, yep. So this thing, I don't, I don't know if I'd call it a statue. It looks more like a bunch of Flintstones wheels stuck on a tablet with writing on them of sorts, doesn't it? Kinda, maybe? Oh, oh, oh. Oh, but it is a statue after all! It's more like a door. By the way, that design was. Yep, there we go. Yes, we should. I mean, that is the thing that we came here for, wasn't it? I thought. <laughs> Alright, so remember, kids, only do three out, oh, three out of the four challenges at most. Do not do the fourth. Otherwise, a great catastrophe will fall the land. I mean, fall on the land. That was poor grammar on my part. But whatever, whatever. You know the deal. Three out of four challenges. Let's do it. This place, pretty neat, gotta say. Mm, yeah, I, I would have guessed that. Well... You know, because I played the game before. <laughs> Not on a first playthrough, but I guess there's a save point there, which I could have used too. So there's a first challenge that we can go into. We cannot do that sort of thing until later on. But uh, if you'd like to take a little exploration, you can go through there and look at other stuff. But I'm just going to go and go into the first challenge as I see it. You know, just like in order. Chilly drafts. I wonder. I wonder. Let's read. Uh-huh. Okay, the challenge of water. The wrathful streams of water dragons you must elude lest you lose your way. What awaits are the familiars of water whose angry spirits seek serenity at your hands. Once they are so calm, the seal of stone shall be no more, bringing conclusion upon the challenge of water. In the chambers of trial, there shall be no record saved, for that in itself, a challenge is posed. So yeah, you can't save your game during these challenges. That is a part of it all. I, I guess I could reread it if I wanted to, but I'm not going to. Now, you see those, that, that set of stairs that I didn't go in? Watch what happens if you fall off. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> Don't worry, it's okay. Those stairs that we've seen earlier, this is just like the quote-unquote punishment area of sorts, yeah. It just takes you back to the start if you should fall off. So let's be careful here. Watch for the Gyarados streams of water. Just go nice and carefully, softly across the bridges. We should be okay. There's a double dose of hydro pump or whatever the heck this is right there. And there we go. That's how you do the first challenge. Not too difficult. And I guess that... <laughs> I don't know. I didn't really seem to get wet there. And that was the challenge. Or was it? There's more! King Jaws attack! Yep. Oh no! Oh no! They go into the water and everything. That's never a good sign. Ah, mm. oh, poopers. I've seen a good opportunity there. Ah, oh, you had to go underwater, didn't you? Didn't you? Well, I could always do one of these things because why not? That's a that's an option that I can do. Uh, I should probably try circling them both at once, yeah. That was a good place, just an odd hand angle for me to do that. Woo! So yeah, that made things a little bit easier, doing that discharge. Heck yeah! As I said before, don't be afraid to use your Poké Assists, as some of them are trickier than others. And unfortunately, we will not be able to use the power of King Jaw, for they will be instantaneously released after said battle. Well, capture. <laughs> And, well, looks like we don't even get a reward for that. Woo! Victory! Happy days! Woo. And... There they go. <laughs> How sad. How sad. Indeed. But now, um... We're gonna see... Back over here, this is the place I haven't showed you yet. It's right in the middle of the area. These light up as you clear challenges. I'll, pa I'll be passing by that a little bit later on. But yeah, um, we can't go back in them 
once we already do a challenge, that's why I want to show the punishment areas first, just in case I don't fail them. Oh, and I guess I could show you, here's where the torches are, and whatnot. Yep, yep, yep. Huh? Huh? Oh! Let's see the statue. Is it like the one at the entrance? No, it's of an Entei. It looks so noble, so beautiful, so lifelike. Yes. No volcanoes here, though, so no Entes will be born. Yeah. Yeah, it's probably just something that ancient people worshipped or whatever. But, wait, wait, what if I were to chat with the statue? Uh... <laughs> Okay, so second challenge is over on this side, at least second challenge that I'm gonna do is over on this side. It's right there, but I'm gonna go and do a little exploration over here at the upper and side areas here just to show you what's around the place and it's another one of those things. So yeah, it's hinting that there's more to this thing that you'll see in the future, but for now, challenges, yeah. <laughs> Quiet, oh no, too quiet. Maybe, maybe there's ghost Pokemon are gonna attack you! Oh, oh, never mind. I'm just scaring myself, just scaring myself. Challenge of destruction, what is this craziness? Hmm, hmm. I mean, why would I want to destroy the temple? It seems like it's counterproductive to the temple's challenges, doesn't it? I mean, if you destroy the temple, there's no challenges to be had. So yeah. <laughs> And I'll show you the punishment area, I suppose, because chances are I'm not going to be knocked into it. Probably. So, yeah, here is the way back to the stairs should you, yeah, ever get knocked down into the hole or fall down into the hole on this challenge. And here we go. So we got some flashy flashies going on here. What are these things? Well, they look like familiar symbols. Don't they? Don't they? Nah, no Pokemon around anywhere. I wonder... Hmm, yeah, but we don't have them. So I wonder where those captured Pokemon could be- OH NO! Oh, what have I done? I've hit a hidden switch that I didn't know about in the slightest! So yeah, these Pokemon will have the powers that be that will allow us to get progress. Like our- I'm used to capturing from the cliff sides. Come on, don't do that. I just want you to go, like, yeah, somewhere in the middle. Yeah! Oh, shoot! That was unfortunate. Ah! Ah! You stinker! How am I not capturing you by now? There we go. <laughs> I think this one takes the longest out of all the challenges to uh, actually pull off and whatnot. But, uh, we'll see how it goes, I suppose. So, yeah, we can use one to destroy that, the other one to destroy the other one. And now, this isn't necessarily a split path, per se, like you might think. I mean, yeah, there is things both ways, but... I do believe, if I recall correctly, there's only, like, one way to do this. That one looked pretty cool. <laughs> it's called a Citrus Stone. But yeah, I believe the right path is to the left, so I'm gonna go over to the right. Because that's just what I do. We got a Meowth, we got a Wurmple. I do believe the Wurmples are completely useless for this challenge. But I gotta get him out of the way, nonetheless. Ah! I was too slow. Oh, oh, come on, you. Yeah, do the slashies. Oh! Or scratchies. Ah! Oh, man! Oh, man! <laughs> That's alright. All is well. So, yeah, the Wurmples. Not, not really gonna have a field move for you. <laughs> but you can use the Meowth, however. Meow! Meow! <laughs> That's right! <laughs> that was terrible voice acting. <laughs> and let's see, what, look at that, see that, see that? Yeah, we, we're hit, we had a hit dead end here, but... There are Pokémon that we can capture here to recover our Styler, which will come in handy. Uh-huh, uh-huh. So that makes it worthwhile taking the route that is not the correct route. Yes, 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 and back we go. By the way, don't push against any of these open slots on the walls there, otherwise you will fall down into the punishment area and have to restart this all the way from the beginning. Like, literally have to break apart these statues and capture all these Pokémon all over again from the very start. So, yeah, it's... You don't really want to do that on this one. <laughs> uh, I'm not gonna be able to catch you in time, so I'm just gonna let you go. Uh, there we go. Why was I circling vertically when I should be circling horizontally? I don't know. 
but it somehow managed to work out, and hold on, the phone is ringing for some reason. Ah, why is it doing that lately when I record? Alright, I'm back! <laughs> So, as you can see with the power of Crushy Crush, we may go through this one now! Yes! 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 <laughs> Explosions, for some reason. And, 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 we got two. Does that mean, yep, two appropriate Pokemon to crush through? I'm gonna break through them. <laughs> And uh, well, I probably should go for this one first, because I think it requires less circles. Uh, oh shoot, no, I think they were about the same, weren't they? I wasn't really counting. Uh, ah, ha, ha, I circled right around your punch. How do you like those apples, Macha? Well, you probably like them quite a bit, because I'm you're my friend now. <laughs> so, okay, the power of fighting goes through there. And then the power of smashing goes north. Uh, oh, 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 there we go. Yes, I will have to release those Wurmple eventually. I'll probably end up having to do that when I gather too many Pokémon for my own good, because more, more Wurmple are coming. As a matter of fact, this is a dead end here, but I need the Pokémon that's here in order to make progress. Oh, maybe I don't. I thought I needed the Pokémon here to make progress elsewhere. Uh, well, I could, in theory, run from this, but eh. I'd rather have more Magnemite than I would Wurmple, because, yeah, the Magnemites help me recover my Styler while the Wurmples do not. As a matter of fact, uh, I could do that now, because they're just going to be released by the end of my challenge anyway. And, yeah, just... and I'm, I'm expecting that I'm going to do pretty well in the last of these, you'll see what I mean. So let's just kind of let them flutter about. There we go. And this one's... Oh! Oh, I took a little damage there, and it only took one circle. I thought it was more than that for the C dot, but I guess not. I guess not, but yeah, full of energy. And yeah, I'll, I'll get rid of all those. <laughs> the Wurmple's not very helpful here, sorry guys. You are Kawaii, but Kawaii does not help us get through the challenges. <laughs> Woo! There we go. Another one. Bites the dust, and the soda kind of is dust. Um, which one had the dead end that I needed something to get forward? Maybe it was the, the right path that had the dead end that's that's in the square that I'm in right now? Maybe? Might be? Could be? I just remember there being specifically one solution to this, and that you couldn't really fail at it as long as you kept capturing the Pokémon. Basically. So yeah, like, see, right here, and I don't have anything for the smashy smashies up above, so I gotta go back over to the right, even though that north is the way to the uh, end of the challenge. See that? See, that's the only, yeah, it's only one pathway spot there, so this one will give me the power of Shelgon, and this will allow me to get that last one. I believe this one's kind of tricky to do. Uh, yeah, it's, it's got a rather haphazard attack. Um, could you, like, attack? Well... Oh, maybe it's not that tricky as I remember it. Hmm. Which one in this area am I thinking is tricky? Because I keep thinking things are tricky and they're not tricky. But maybe it's because I'm just more experienced at the game than I was in my first couple playthroughs of this? Maybe? Anyway, Shelgon, do your thing! We've seen all the paths, so... Down the last barricade goes. And behold, a heal up, and all the Pokemon gets released. That's what I meant about that. I might as well just, yeah, use them up now anyway, just to make sure that I've got the power. In fact, I could have used the Magnemite before that battle, or even during the battle, and it wouldn't have made much of a difference. So here we are. Something is coming in, Dino. <laughs> One of the most powerful dragons ever! Beware as it's... Oh, it seems slow, doesn't it? Doesn't it? Well, if you do that, yeah. <laughs> and it's got a lot of stuff to circle. So, uh, you might wanna... Might wanna strategically do your circling around that hyper beam. Or... Or... 
You see where I'm going with this? I just, it just needs to be in the right- Whoa, jeez! just needs to be in the right position, though. Uh, there we go. Wait for it. Wait for it. There we go. Let's circle like mad. Uh, all right, it's resistant. Oopsie. So I'm gonna have to do this normally, I suppose. Aha! <laughs> ah! You and your viciousness. <laughs> I could, well, maybe if I charge a discharge up a little bit more, I should be okay. Or maybe I'm better off getting it while it's flying. Who knows? Who knows? I kind of forgot. That's okay, though. I'll get it. Don't you worry. Not touching, not touching. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's better off when it's flying. That's how you get it. Okay, yeah, so it's gonna slam on the ground. It's gonna reset the, uh, the timer, I guess you could say, eventually. There we go. And it's gonna go on the ground, do that to make it hyper beam, and then it's gonna fly up in the air eventually again. <laughs> eventually, come on, do your thing. Come on. I know your tricks again now. <laughs> Maybe if I, maybe I have to do that to get it to go back up in the air. Uh, maybe. Yep, that's how you do it. <laughs> okay. Circle, circle, circle. Oh no! I let it go too early. That's how you do it, though. <laughs> All right, get back up in the air. Get, just get your body back up in the air. <laughs> Come on, you can do it. This is quite the battle, or should see, quite the capture. Eh, come on, come on, come on. Eh, wide circles, wide circles, never know where it's gonna move. Yeah, I got it! Woo! -hoo -hoo! That was awesome! Probably the toughest capture yet, actually. So yeah, that's the thing that I remember that was so difficult. It wasn't the rest of the poop, it was this boss. Yup, challenge cleared! Heck, yeah! And let's teleport ourselves out with the power of a black screen, because why not? And sadly, Salamence has got to go back. <laughs> Woo! Alright. Two hour lights. One more to do. And then that will be it for all the challenges that I'm able to do without catastrophically destroying the world. <laughs> yes, but... I'm going to save that other challenge for the next part, so I hope you enjoy, and I will see you then! Woo!